Thank you. Another exciting day. It's a great day for Tempur-Pedic International, an innovative Kentucky company that has built a reputation of literally putting people to sleep. <laughs> and I must tell you, Mark, the governor and first lady sleep on a Tempur-Pedic mattress at home right here in central Kentucky. It's also a great day, obviously, for Lexington and central Kentucky, an area whose vibrant business growth is ranking high on the list of everybody from Forbes magazine to federal financial experts. It's also great for our Kentucky families. You know, this project is going to be, as I understand, about an $18 million investment for the company. And that is a wonderful opportunity for Central Kentucky. But a number I like even better is it's going to create 65 new jobs for Kentuckians and Kentucky families right here in Central Kentucky. That is indeed cause for celebration. It's also great for the Commonwealth of Kentucky because it keeps our momentum going as we continue to turn our economy around and come out of this horrible recession that we've all been experiencing. I want to congratulate Mark Sarvery, who, as we know, is the CEO and president of the company, and the rest of his team at Tempur-Pedic International. What an exciting day to have their global headquarters, a company that operates around the world. They're going to have their global headquarters right here in Lexington, Kentucky. This company's story is an interesting account of innovation, creativity, and entrepreneurship. One that, as we all know, harkens back to our nation's space program. We're excited to help this company break ground on this new 125,000 square foot global headquarters. We appreciate their continued confidence in our economy and our workforce, and we welcome this addition of a new business on this exciting campus here at Cold Stream. This expansion represents a successful partnership among state and local governments, university leaders, and a fast-growing global company, the best in public and private collaboration. You know, when we overhauled our economic development toolbox in the summer of 2009, one of our goals was to improve our ability to work with existing companies looking to expand their facilities, their operations, their product lines, and their workforces. Today's groundbreaking and the state's partnership is yet another example of how our performance-based incentives have become an important tool in helping those companies succeed. New and existing companies have announced the creation of more than 1,400 new jobs in Lexington in the last three years. These economic development projects together represent a potential capital investment of more than $190 million in the Commonwealth of Kentucky. We're talking about companies like Tiffany, Neogen, Transposigen, GE Lighting, Florida Tile, and now Tempur-Pedic International. It's little wonder that the U.S. Bureau of Economic Analysis named Lexington's economy the 65th fastest growing metropolitan area in the whole country last year. This is testimony to the hard work of a lot of people and our refusal, our refusal to hunker down and hide during this recession. We decided instead to be even more aggressive and what we're seeing today is part of what that aggressiveness will create. Congratulations to everybody.